In this video, we're going to tie the Palomar knot. This is a very popular knot. It is a small, strong, and easy to tie, uh, hence the popularity. So let's go ahead and get started. And really the first step is to put the hook down, essentially, and, and uh, double over the line. So we're going to get a doubled over line. I typically get about maybe five inches or so, five, six inches, just to make sure that it's uh, easy to tie and you have plenty of line to work with. And so at the end of this loop is we need to just really pinch it down because what we need to do is we need to thread this through the eye of the hook. So uh, we'll get it nice and small. That way it'll fit through the hook like so. So, uh, so now we just have a hook that's basically just floating on this doubled over line. And so the next step is to do just a simple overhand knot, just the, the basic knot of, uh, of all knots essentially. And, uh, and I typically get about, uh, try to you know, get a decent amount of tagging over here to the left. Uh, you'll see why that is needed in a second. So anyhow, just to explain where we are, we, all we've done is put the hook on a doubled line and did a single overhand knot, and that, that hook is sitting inside of that knot right now. So then with this tag in over on the left side, with the reason why we have it a fairly good size is that we have to put the hook through it. So you have to put the hook through that loop, and, um, and this could be problematic if you're using a big lure. That's the only bad part about this knot. If you're using a big lure, that's tough, but of course with a bare hook, that is very easy. And uh, so now it's, uh, it's a matter of just tightening everything down. Um, that's all you really have to do, and, and uh, in tightening it down, just make sure that the, uh, that second loop doesn't get caught up underneath the hook. Down here at the bottom part of the hook is that little ridge, and that could, uh, that could damage your line. So just be very mindful of uh, not getting snagged there. And so now it's really simple as just, uh, as just putting pressure on it, and uh, right uh, just before doing that, it would be smart to, to put some either saliva or water on the knot just to make sure it doesn't burn itself but uh, I'm just doing this to show you how to tie the actual knot. So uh, this last part, just go ahead and tighten it down, and you'll see this is a nice small, uh, small knot that uh, is extremely, extremely strong. And so that's it. Uh, next, uh, the final step is really just to trim off the, uh, the tag end, and, uh, and that is really all you have to do. That is the Palomar knot. And again, it's a nice small, again, as you saw, that was not very complicated, just easy knot to tie. And, uh, and rated as one of the, the strongest knots out there. So thanks so much for your time and watching this video. We hope you enjoyed it, and uh, we hope you get on the water soon and catch some monster fish.